On Friday, voters will go to the polls to decide on whether to remove or to keep the Eighth Amendment from our Constitution. Warder, can you not see it? This was the most historically divisive issue in Ireland ever. We've waited 35 years. We've just for one week to do it, and we're going to bring it home. Women are still travelling, women are still in danger. This government needs to protect women's lives. We absolutely have to do something. What they're trying to do is take God out of society. Sadly, the answer is, we'll just get rid of it, instead of, what do you need? There was that sense that women couldn't be trusted. And I think the women of Ireland have rolled over for long enough. Why can't I love glitz and glamour and still feel passionately about women's rights? Imagine if you could get this army of women putting that pressure on and to feel empowered. Something magical happened where it became a symbol of women's equality in Ireland. All these stories being somehow set free of to try and change the country. It's actually about the value that we're putting on women in Irish society. People do recognise it's a kind of a backlash. What happens here in Ireland will have a knock-on effect. We are creating an Ireland which values women, our bodies, our choices, ourselves, our lives absolutely equally. Repeal the eight.